She said, Santa baby, Snap was saying a laundry for me. I don't know what a stable is, but I'd rather have a car. <laughs> Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, I mean who else could it be? You clicked on this page so you already know. It's your girl, King Lex. Are you blessed and bougie? Cause I know I am. You said what? My hair matches my nails? You said you need me to come closer? I got you. You said my hair matches my nails? Is that what you said? Because if you said that, you were right. If you said that the hues of burgundy and the hues of the nails matched, she said, per. Today, you guys, we are going to be making DIY hot cocoa bombs, hot chocolate bombs, whatever kind of bomb you want to call it, and get this. We're going to make them without the mold. You heard me. Let me tell you something. I went to three different stores trying to find those silicone little sphere circle molds. Couldn't find them. And I was like, oh, they're on Amazon. First of all, then I could get here at time, even if I got the prime delivery. So I was like, no, I can't do all that. I went to Target. I was trying to get like muffin pans, anything to make that little sphere type shape, that circle, the bomb shape. Couldn't find anything. They were sold out of everything. Even online, they said they had it. They need to update it. So, I found a different way to make them. But before we get into it, you already know. <laughs> if you're not part of the fam, I'm gonna need you to hit that subscribe button right here. Get this video a cute little thumbs up or whatever. And go ahead and turn on those post notifications so we can get into it and you can get all the content. Shout out to the 15 subscribers. Hold on. Y'all got me feeling real celebrity-ish. <laughs> I got 15 subscribers in less than a week. I know that might not be a lot to y'all, but let me tell you, as a small YouTuber trying to come up, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of competition, but ain't nothing like me. It ain't nothing like me. But I just want to shout out to all 15 of you. You know who you are. Thank you so much for becoming part of the fam. It's like my own little personal Christmas gifts, like 15 subscribers. <laughs> Haters, stay mad. <laughs> so to make these hot chocolate bombs, you're going to need some hot cocoa mix. This is just Swiss Miss. Actually, I took all of this off of my hot chocolate station, so that's why I sent little cute jars. If not, it wouldn't be all that cute. Swiss Miss. Hot chocolate mix right here. I got some semi-sweet chocolate chips, some marshmallows, and then I have some white chocolate. And then I have some candy cane that I'm gonna use right here. I'm actually gonna use these little candy cane peppermint balls that I have so I can mess up my decoration. And so you might say, Lex, how are we gonna get the shape without having the mold? Hey, don't worry. We're gonna use foil and an orange, a cutie. I got this idea from, hold on, cause I don't, <laughs> I don't be remembering stuff like that. Easy DIY hot chocolate bombs was from Dream Flight 6000. That's a lot. She made them and I was like, get out of here! Instead of running around like a chicken with my head cut off trying to find somebody's mold, I got some aluminum foil. The Lord told me to get some foil the other day. I won't go get none and I got some, so here it is. Uh-uh. She needs to start herself because if I cut myself, I'm gonna have a serious problem. Now this is my first time making them. So please do not come for me. If it come out looking crazy, mind your business, stay in your lane, cause I don't have time for that. The gag is you take the foil, right? And to make the mold, you put it down in here and that's how you make the mold. Oh my God, this is so freaking smart. Whoever was like, this is a good idea. Shout out to you bro, or boy or whoever. Shout out to you. We're gonna go to a close up view so y'all can get into it. So if y'all ready, come on over here and follow me. I have my shape right here. I'm still trying to make my mold. He pretty much just put it down in there because that's what she said. So you put it down here and kind of let it drop out and then you still have the mold, you see? Oh my God, I just feel so inventive even though I didn't come up with it. I just feel so cute. And these are some chocolate pieces from a bar that I had when I was making s'mores. I just have four pieces in there and then I'm gonna add some more because I'm not quite sure how much this calls for, but she's so cute. Okay, that should be enough. And I'm gonna put it in the microwave for a minute, but I'm gonna stir every 20 seconds. Oh my God, I almost let it go past on accident. Ain't nothing metal. This is what I be talking about. Didn't, girl, let's try again. Okay, we got our chocolate. She's all melty and sturdy. Now we're gonna fill our molds. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous about this. All right, ready y'all? We're gonna see how she do, okay? 
<laughs> Gently, evenly spread it around. Get in there. You wanna make sure all of it's covered. If my calculations are correct, all I have to do is pop this in the refrigerator for about two minutes and let her freeze and we gonna see how she comes out. While I wait for that to freeze, I'm gonna go ahead and make like two more so that way I can have that out of the way. Okay, I'm gonna try to get it out without breaking it up. Oh my God, I'm so nervous. She said, pull gently. Ah! No, it's coming off. Look, it's coming off, y'all. Gently? No, 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 no. It's not ready. I feel like it needs like another minute to chill. I don't know what kind of recipe she was following, but no, she need a couple more minutes. Hold on. So I really wanted to make one of them white chocolate, so I'm gonna sprinkle a little more white chocolate chips. Okay. I don't need that many because I'm just making one. Now I'm gonna heat those up and get it cracking. Let me check on my other bomb. Okay, she's coming off a little easier now. So she's messed up already. You know, we're gonna take it as a learning experience so we know what not to do. Hopefully the other one comes out way better. She kind of looks like a Reese's cup. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so horrible. I'm so sad. They make it look so easy. This is not right. Shut up. No, okay, so we're gonna scratch that. That was my tester, okay? I got my chocolate chips, my white chocolate melted. Eh. I'm ready to take this all right. I think it cracked already, so my heart is like shattered. But it's okay, we're gonna try this again. One eternity later. Another failure. Y'all see it, right? I feel like I'm being tricked, bamboozled. I feel like I'm being lied to. I'm wasting chocolate, resources, energy, lighting, money. So y'all are gonna laugh, but I promise I don't care. So I have this pineapple mold, right? Look at this, it's silicone, okay? I can't get these bombs to do right. I'm gonna make pineapple bombs. Damn it. We gonna start with the white chocolate cause I'm fed up now, okay? And I'm gonna put this in here. And she gonna come out the proper way. She gonna be real cute. And I mean it, period. And goodbye. Oh, not goodbye. Don't stop watching. I'm gonna put these in there for five minutes. Cinco minutos. So while I wait for five minutes, the peppermint that I'm gonna put on top of it, I'm about to crush these up. Dang, I don't have a mallet. Guess I gotta use what I have. Okay, ready? All you gotta do is pretend that it's somebody that you don't like, and then you just do it. Like, you just be like, yeah, yeah. I don't really need all of this, so I have enough crush to make my little topping. Oh my gosh, it's spilling. Yeah, don't, probably shouldn't do that. If this don't come out right, I'm truly gonna have a problem. Like, I'm all about cooking, but stuff like this, it's a lot, and it's stressful, and it's a lot, and I don't like to fail, so. Has it been five minutes? I don't know. Okay, it's been like seven minutes. I honestly don't even wanna do this. So well, these are actually really deep in there. I feel like they're just gonna die and fall apart. Ah! Okay, screwed up the first one, she cracked in half. Okay, well there's the bottom part, yeah. Mm-hmm, here's the top. <laughs> it might not be a great one, but I have an idea. The back is cute though. The back is real cute. So they say in order to smush them together, you need a warm plate, so I'm gonna warm this up for like a minute. So I'm gonna take the biggest of the shells <laughs> and I'm gonna put the hot cocoa mix inside like this is really bad if you do this better which pretty much everybody's gonna do it better than me please let me know so i can see because this is this is all so depressing we're gonna sift it in here <laughs> oh my god y'all this is so trash 
I'm gonna take a separate plate, not the warm one. Put it on here, take my other piece that has nothing in it, stick it on the plate. This is to melt it. See if it works, cause that's what everybody else did. But Lord Jesus knows, this ain't everybody else stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna stick it on there so they make a little circle. So it kinda looks like a little marshmallow. So mix came out, oh my God. And I'm gonna take some more melted white chocolate and I'm gonna smooth it together. I'm gonna smooth around it like create a mold around it because like I said, I wasn't about to waste this. So I'm creating a mold. There's my bomb. Honestly, I don't care. This is for some hot chocolate. Y'all can see me fail. Y'all ain't gonna see it again, but. <laughs> Okay, get on there, stay on there. This is really hard to do with nails as well. No need for decoration because she's beautiful, isn't she? While I'm waiting on that, I'm gonna go ahead and heat up my milk. I just have some almond milk, I mean vanilla. She's lactose or whatever, so I'm gonna go ahead and heat my milk up. Even though I'm fully aware this is all gonna look crazy, it still gonna taste good though. All right, y'all, I got my little, um, uh, <laughs> I even had the nerve to try to put some drizzle on top. <laughs> All right, you know what, whatever. It is what it is, all right. I'ma drop her in there. Oh my gosh, she didn't break up though. It disappeared. Are you there? Oh, there she goes. She, oh, so she disintegrated. Since it's a boot, it probably went all the way down in there. Oh yeah, it's stuck down in there. <laughs> We're just gonna put a little, few more little scoops in here. Just you know, a few more. I am so ashamed. Y'all better not tell nobody. I'm truly just annoyed because I had every intention of this coming out good. And I really wanted this to be a little festive, cute moment. And it's not. Honestly, it is what it is. I don't care, I'm gonna put some marshmallows up in here though. Because I can still make a hot chocolate the old fashioned way. Y'all and your bombs, I mean, you shouldn't even be saying that. You shouldn't be saying the word B-O-M-B -B, to be honest, D. I had higher hopes for her, she let me down. But it's okay, you know, you live and you learn, you make your mistakes. I bet it tastes good though. Exactly. Her. If I ever decide to try this foolishness again, I will get the mold off Amazon. Some things, you know, you try to DIY, you be like, Oh, I can make that happen. I can make that work. Girl, no. It's the reason why you need the mold. I'm so excited about this. Spend my money. God. Hope you guys enjoyed my video. It's Christmas week. That's what y'all give me for Christmas. I'll wait. Y'all ain't gonna give me nothing. Y'all's love and support is enough for me. So, as always, stay blessed, beautiful, and bougie. And don't come for my hot chocolate bombs. I know they were ghetto. Don't come for them. I come for you, and I'll see you guys at the next video. She's good. Purr, and we out.